everyone and welcome to my channel. Today we are going to be reviewing the wonderful book, The Map Makers. The book after The Hat Makers, which we reviewed last time. So I just have a few shout outs to my five subscribers. My mum, my dad, my granny, my dance teacher Zaria and my friend Nate, who... Hi Nate, I'm sure is going to be watching this as soon as I release it because he's turned notifications on. Jeez, Nate. Um, so I'm going to read you the blurb. Ever since Cordelia Hatmaker discovered a hidden map in her missing father's precious telescope, she has searched London for him by starlight. She is sure Prospero is out there, somewhere. She never expects to stumble upon a secret society of map makers. Or to learn that magic is all around, if only you know where to look. But danger is lurking around every corner. And Cordelia must convince the rival maker families to work together to bring her family home and save magic itself. Um, so some of the main character vis characters of this book are... Cordelia, who's actually the main character, she's here. Goose, whose actual name is Lucas, who's right here too. And Sam, who we discovered in the last book, is a girl. There are also, there's also um, Lord Whitloof, who, I don't want to spoil it actually, um, and Mrs. Hardbottom, was it? Stairbottom? Um, no. Her real last name is Canemaker. Mrs. Canemaker. Um, and basically just Cordelia's family and Cordelia's father. Um, this book is good for ages. Probably, if they were really good at reading, six to, yeah, 10,188 or something. Um, but... Four and up would love it if you read it um, to them because it's kind of a hard book to read but it's a very, very good book, very, very good like plot and stuff. Um, so here are the ratings. They're basically the same as last time if you, you know. Utterly charming, says Anna James. Wildly inventive, says Catherine, Catherine Doyle. Absolutely wonderful, says Emma Carroll, and imaginative, says The Times. And the best book in the world, says Olive Redmayne. Me. <laughs> um, yeah, guys, just remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next week on Friday. Bye!